Today's horoscope, Libra August 29, 2024. Discover your future with my daily horoscope for you about love, work, health, money and compatibility with other signs. Today marks the end of Mercury's retrograde cycle since the 5th, and the resolution of many recent misunderstandings. The shift itself has the initial effect of magnifying problem areas, but you'll be enjoying fewer delays or blocks going forward. Information can arrive that rounds out your understanding in the days ahead. Today, take special care in your interactions with others and consider that you may be missing important details. Venus opposes Neptune, muddying the waters further. Temporarily, the ordinary doesn't appeal, but you could also find it difficult to feel satisfied with this transit in play. Ambiguities related to a disorganized state or your work or health can leave you feeling a little drained and uncertain of your next step. Deception or self-deception is a possibility. Dream, be inspired, and create, but be cautious when it comes to your practical affairs. Perhaps most importantly, watch that you don't fall for something that seems a lot more glamorous than it actually is. Distinguish between wishful thinking and intuition. Finally, Mercury is no longer retrograde as of today. Four weeks he'd been back and forth in your solar house of friendships, communities, and groups. He will be picking up the pace and orbiting here until September 9, 2024. Fun, games, events, and socializing are all here for the taking in the weeks ahead. Singles should use this festive energy to update their dating profiles and connect digitally with new options or suitors, as Mercury is the planet of technology and communication. However, don't just wait for them to come to you. Be direct and on top of it. Love does not sleep or wait. Love is in action. Embrace this wisdom. Gather your courage to go after the job that you want. The last few weeks may have shown you what you should be doing for work. Reflect on what has come up when Venus in Virgo opposes Neptune retrograde in Pisces and Mercury stations direct in Leo. A dream job may come to mind during this cosmic energy. Instead of feeling unsure and insecure, you may feel more confident in pursuing this dream job. It is time for you to create the work and life you want to have. Go after your dreams and see where they take you. Regularity in practice is the answer to almost all of your health concerns. You will benefit tremendously from a regular yoga practice, running, or gym workout. Exercise can be almost a religious practice for some, for it relieves the nervousness and anxiety that plague everyday living. Finding a reason for the health regimen you keep is a good idea. This is a good time to ask yourself, what is health all about for me? Things are moving, and all for the better. In love, the wind is blowing in the right direction. If you are single, you will embark on some new adventures and meet new people, flirt and have evenings out, if possible. If you are part of a couple, your relationship will suddenly be more exciting and you will be tantalized by your partner. A hot day is waiting for you, let everyone around you be warned. Currently, while the moon will conclude the day in your career sector and during the heart of the working week, this positioning offers an advantage. However, a stronger pull comes from its final hours in your sector of adventure, travel, learning, and discovery aligned with Mars. This timing adds fuel to Mars' passion for adventure just as Pluto is days away from retrograding out of a playful and creative part of your chart. With Mars returning to your career sector next week alongside an active playful and adventurous side of life by then, it's important to establish some boundaries first. Two days before Venus, the planet of love is due to return to Libra, the moon's departure from an adventurous part of your chart wraps up a visit that has added fuel to an already potent mix of nostalgia, romance, passion, and adventure. This is something that Venus will have access to when she returns to work her magic. Daily Planetary Overview Where do you draw the line in the sand? Today is all about setting clear and concise boundaries in your relationships, as Venus in Virgo opposes Neptune retrograde in Pisces. This cosmic alignment encourages you to be honest and direct about your needs and expectations. Think of this moment as an opportunity to reclaim your voice and set the record straight. Whether it's in your personal life, work environment, or even with friends, now is the time to communicate your perspective with clarity and confidence. 
Luckily, with Mercury stationing direct in Leo, you'll find that expressing yourself comes more easily than usual. Have you ever been in a situation where you knew what you wanted to say, but the words just didn't come out right? Today, the universe has your back. You'll be able to articulate your thoughts clearly and in a way that resonates with those around you. So, don't hold back speak up and let others know where you stand. It's important to remember that setting boundaries isn't about pushing people away, it's about creating healthy spaces in your relationships where mutual respect and understanding can flourish. When you communicate openly, you give others the chance to understand you better, and in turn, this strengthens your connections. Have you ever noticed how a difficult conversation can sometimes bring you closer to someone? That's the kind of growth that boundary setting can create. Today, as you navigate these conversations, trust your instincts. Rely on your sound common sense and intuitive guidance to make decisions that are right for you. You're in control, and you know what's best for your well-being. Sometimes, when we dig deep into the details of a situation, we find that the facts and figures don't tell the whole story. This is where your gut instinct comes in it will guide you to make choices that align with your true self. Even though you may feel extra sensitive today, don't let that stop you from speaking your truth. Sensitivity isn't a weakness, it's a strength. It allows you to approach conversations with empathy and emotional sincerity, something that others especially the women in your life will deeply appreciate. Have you ever found that your ability to listen and understand makes people feel more comfortable opening up to you? Today, that emotional intelligence will help you positively influence the discussions you have. At the same time, be mindful of your own emotional needs. If you're feeling overwhelmed, remember to take care of yourself. Pay attention to any physical warning signals your body might be sending you. Stress can sneak up on us, and it's important to find balance before it becomes too much. Have you ever been tempted by distractions like that irresistible slice of cake or the shiny new item in the shop window? Today, indulgences may seem especially hard to resist, but try to exercise a little self-control. While it's okay to treat yourself, don't let momentary pleasures lead to regrets later on. This period of introspection may bring some inconsistencies to the surface, and that's okay. We all have moments where our emotions influence our actions more than we expect. You might even surprise yourself with how differently you're behaving today, and others might take notice too. Use this as an opportunity to show the people closest to you a new side of your personality. Have you ever had a day where you felt more bold or daring than usual, and it caught people off guard? Embrace that side of you, it's all part of your unique journey. However, be cautious not to let your emotional mood lead to unnecessary conflicts. If you find yourself engaging in a bit of verbal sparring, try to keep it light. Sometimes, when we flex our mental muscles and provoke others, they take it as a challenge and retaliate just as forcefully. Remember, there's no need to turn a friendly debate into a personal attack. Have you ever walked away from an argument only to regret the things you said in the heat of the moment? Avoid that by recognizing when it's time to step back and cool down. There's power in knowing when to pause and choose peace over proving a point. So, as you go through the day, embrace the opportunity to set boundaries, nurture your relationships, and protect your energy. How are you planning to take charge of your needs today? What conversations are you ready to have to create more balance and harmony in your life? Let's share our experiences and support each other on this journey of growth and self-care. Remember, you're not alone a euro we're all learning to navigate the art of setting boundaries together.